<laughs> yes, we're going to Florida today. Yay! <laughs> I've been, been to Florida. South America. I've been yeah. there. Yeah, I've been. I've been to Florida. I was in there. I was in the state of Florida for about eight hours. That's <laughs> just in and gone. But so I didn't get to see too much. But we've covered Florida a lot on this show, and there's always something interesting to talk about when it comes to Florida. A Florida man's desire to change the nearby lake is becoming very controversial. Why would the name of a lake be controversy at all? I mean, and why would you want to change the name of a lake? I mean, what would be wrong with it? Well, in this instance, the lake is called Lake Horny. H-O-R-N-E-Y. Lake Horny. I'm imagining that at some point there was somebody actually had that name. Yeah, and, and that's so, why it's named after someone. Yeah. It's just an ideological. Yeah. So <laughs> Zimmerman told the board, this is the guy who wants to have the name changed. His name is Barry Zimmerman. <laughs> he lives on the lake shores of Lake Horny. He petitioned to change the name because he's sick of the salacious jokes that keep popping up when people mention Lake Horny. You know what? Fucking deal with it, dude. Just because you are uncomfortable with the name and you think that, oh, people are making jokes at the expense of that. that I would love to live in a place with I, a like, funny name like that. I would, too. I would be exactly. like, you want to come over? Hey, I live over at Lake Harney. Yeah. And then, then, <laughs> yeah, so I could just see that. Line. Yeah, oh, it is. I mean, well, <laughs> I'm sure you get your face slapped a few times, but, hey, you never know. You might get the one. <laughs> It's a fun pickup line. Let's yeah. put it like that. I have a. I, I've lived on a lot of unusual places with uh, very unusual names, and the one, I, the where I'm at currently, I, I I tell them that, and they look at me, and go, really? I said, yes, really. That's really where the place the address I live at. Like, okay. <laughs> Zimmerman has petitioned the U.S. Board of Ge Geographic Names to rename the lake, according to the Lake Lend Ledger newspaper. He told the, the board that he does not want to denigrate Mr. Horney's contributions to the history of Lakeland, but he wants the name change because of it's a <laughs> homonomic to a vulgar term meaning... I like that they point out what it's a, uh, a, a common term for. Like, people just don't, won't know. Yeah. <laughs> it, it means that you're horny. I mean... It's not like, it's not like some obscure word. Like, right. It's... <laughs> In an unrelated note, the, the word horny, there was this old TV show called Soap, and they wanted to get the word horny into the show, but they knew if they left it in just that one word, they'd say, no, you can't use that word. So they threw in a bunch of, uh, this is how the story goes, they threw in a bunch of other words that they know that they would reject, and they thought, well, if they, if they go through these, they won't see that one, and we they will get it in. And that's exactly how it got in there. <laughs> so it's like, oh, you're not, you're not lonely. You're just horny. So <laughs> so yeah, you look that one up if you want to. I don't know which episode it was, but it's it's it was just a funny story on how they actually got that in there. But <laughs> I got a suggestion for you, dude. Maybe if you pronounce it differently, like horne. There you go. It doesn't sound salacious, really. <laughs> Horne. Or, 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 or just pronounce it like... That like, just sounds pretentious. It does sound pretentious. <laughs> I live on Lake Horne. Horne. I live on Lake Horne. <laughs> it's, it, sounds, it almost sounds French. So yeah. Like, Ooh. Or Lake Canadian. Horne. Or Canadian, yeah. So Horne. Oh. <laughs> either that or you say it's a sauce. It's like... It, yeah, it's named after the Horne sauce. You know, it's... <laughs> Whatever, you know. <laughs> I want to make a sauce cult up now. <laughs> Would you like some horne sauce? <laughs> ew, ew. I just realized. <laughs> Got to hear thoughts. Okay, he obviously bought the house there. They did just recently name the lake that. Uh -huh. they, he knew it was named that when he moved there. Mm-hmm. I, and there's not. It's not just that. There's also uh, two other things in town that are named for this this guy. His name was um, Julius Teague Horny. Yeah. I uh, just. I don't know. I. I just. I just can't. I just. 
and the guy wouldn't even be on camera because I was curious. Okay, what does this Bill Zimmerman, you know, prude look like? And mm. he was like, he declined to be on camera for an interview. Like, oh, I bet he did. <laughs> he's, he's really, he's really like one of maybe two people who want the name change. I think it's just him. Yeah. Everybody else is just fine with it. Yeah. And I go, yeah, he's probably, you know, probably looks like somebody who has a real stick up his ass. Anyway. <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, apparently, a woman also said that she changed the orientation of her house during a remodel so she didn't have to tell people she lived on the Lake Horny Drive. <laughs> That's a, it's like, okay, we're going to turn the whole... All right, the door's going over there. We're actually yeah, on a different drive. We're on, yeah, we're on a... Just move. Yeah, if come the, in. If, if you go into that length, like those lengths, yeah, just move. Move. Just fucking move. Just, uh, if you're, I would if love you're, to live, like, like as, as I said, I would love to live in a place with, like, a funny name. Oh, I would, too. I so too that's yeah. funny now apparently Zimmerman wants to, to drop the Lake Horney and rename it in honor of Alfred Lodwick and an aviation pioneer who built the military pi a pilot training program in Lakeland during World War II but uh, the Ge geographic board has asked the, way, the, the Lakeland officials to weigh in on their options before making the final decisions I hope I really hope they say go go fly a kite Everybody else is fine with it. You're just being a prude. You got a stick up your ass. I, you, how I know you have a stick up your ass? I saw you dragging it in while you're walking in here. I sort of wonder if Zimmerman's, if this, if this uh, pilot guy, this mm -hmm. Alfred Lodwick, if it's a relative of his. Now that would be I, interesting. Or if he's just thinking. like, yeah, if he's like just a big fan and he's just looking for an excuse to name something after him. <laughs> <laughs> after him. I need him to be named after something after him. Yeah, now apparently there was somebody who passionately defended the Lake Horney's name yep. in an editorial. So, yeah. It does well, and it goes the dog. Yeah, it says here this is of course very stupid and should not be condoned. What does this say to all the people out there who have to go through life with unintentionally hilarious names? What of all the Mr. and Mrs. Coxes, Dixes, Cummings, Cockburns and Gaylords? <laughs> Do we say to the residents of Florida that with snicker-worthy last names that no matter how hard they work and no matter how much they contribute to the community, that they can never dream of having a street or park or lake named after them after all because teenagers have ill-developed sense of humor? Hey, I'm not a teenager. Yeah, I have I an ill. To say I'm not a teenager either. I I can't help but snigger at it. Yeah, I can't help. Either. It's yeah. funny. It is. It's incredibly funny. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Blog, do you have any additional thoughts on this? Not really. It's funny. I mean, it's 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 ridiculous. I mean, in Denmark, we literally have a town named Seaman. <laughs> <laughs> we have we have like we have a town named the Danish word for intestine. Oh, really? Yeah. I wow. Mean, it's we we hear things what... have funny names. Yeah. Sometimes we here in Wisconsin. I, and I've been through this city. There's a little. There's a city just way north of me. It's called Spread Eagle. Oh, that's that's <laughs> awesome. That's <laughs> awesome. I was like, it's a small city. I'm going, man. People are getting lucky up here. I'm just saying. <laughs> I would live in Spread Eagle if it wasn't so fucking far north. I'd I'd move to Spread Eagle. <laughs> Yeah, there's a, there's a play. I mean, it's like the the town in Austria that is literally called fucking. Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> they, it's the most stolen. Um, it's the most stolen road sign in in Europe. The town sign. 